Welcome back to my channel. Today is May 24th. It's uh, Tuesday. Yesterday I worked around 11, uh, 11 and a half to 12 hours. I made 203. Uh, it was a small order here, wait an hour, a medium sized order here, wait 45 minutes, another small one. It was, it was that kind of a day, but I was able to hit over 200, which is always nice to start my week. Today is extremely slow. Uh, right now it is 924. I parked at Stater Brothers, the one by my house, at 705. Waited about an hour for a 12. That order took me closer to another Stater Brothers. Came out here, waited about another 30 minutes, and I'm doing another 12 right now. I just grabbed it about two minutes ago. It's 12 items, 14 units, going three miles. Um, I'm pretty much taking, I've pretty much grabbed every order that I've seen. Uh, except for one, it was a $17 order for like 35 items, 62 units going six miles. I did not want to do that. It was a $5 flat tip. I'm good on that. But yeah, this order, $12 going three miles, 12 items. So yeah, let me know how you guys been. I really appreciate all the comments. I love getting back to you guys. It's really fun. And I, I really enjoy making these videos for you guys. Um, I really enjoy the process of editing and, and, and putting out content. And uh, I'm gonna continue to keep pumping out this content for you guys. And I really appreciate the, the growth that I'm getting with the subscribers and all the views. And yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and knock out this order. I'll see you guys on the next one. Let's get it. All right guys, so um, that order was terrible. Uh, the customer did not respond. There was like three items. Three items, I messaged her like four times. I called her three times. I left two voicemails and the order was not good at all so i did not i didn't give her that much time i mean i gave her enough time i gave her enough time to respond but i waited a max of five minutes and i was like nope refund 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 i'm not gonna sit around and wait for your five dollar tip to uh you know whatever i no so the order actually went up to a 13 like almost 14 bucks but it went back down to 12 12.64 so i'm at 25 dollars. not the best start um this order put me next to a ralph's you can't see it a ralph's and i'm next to a cvs i don't plan on taking any cvs orders but i'm next to a ralph's right there i just parked over here because there's some shade but yeah i'm gonna just kind of just go go with the flow and try to scavenge uh up to 150 dollars today that's the goal because tuesdays have recently been pretty bad so that's the plan. I'll let you guys know when I get my next order. Hopefully we can run it up today. Let's get it. All right, guys. So I uh, forgot to mention, I do have Uber Eats on as well. I haven't gotten any orders yet, but I just got a 31 uh, for Ralph's and it's pretty good. It's only going 1.5 miles, uh, 16 items, 20 units for $31. So that's pretty nice. Gonna wait a little bit and try to get an add-on. Yeah, the items look pretty good. A Little bit of produce, some frozen items, really easy. I do enjoy doing Ralph's orders for uh, the simple fact that they have all the, the items with aisle numbers and shelf numbers. I, I think that's really awesome. And I, and I think that all the stores, all the, uh, the, the market stores should do that because obviously at Costco, it's kind of pointless, right? Because there's not that many uh, specific items but for Ralph's to do that it's pretty cool how they have like aisle one shelf four and you can kind of pinpoint where it's at not a great start but I'll take these orders all day long and uh, I was at 25 so yeah it'll be $56 if I'm doing the math correctly so I'm gonna go ahead and knock out this order and I'll let you guys know what I get after let's get it alright guys so it is now 1149 I just got back to Ralph's that was actually a really good uh, order. It was the 31, I got a $27 add-on. It turned into be a $59 order. That put me at 84 bucks for the day. And I am back outside of Ralph's right now. And it was really good. The, the, the batch pay from Instacart was only $14. So that's a $45 tip. That was pretty sweet. I needed that. I'll let you guys know when I get my next one. Let's get it. All right guys, so I almost waited an hour. I was approaching my hour mark but I got a 59 for one for Ralph's. It is 40 items, 59 units going, I think it was 2.9 miles. So man, I grabbed that so fast, my heart was pounding. And that's really good because that's gonna put me at 142. 
So I'm gonna, I'm gonna be $8 away from my bare minimum goal today. And obviously now I kind of have to go for 200 because I am taking tomorrow off. So me knowing that I'm taking tomorrow off, I know I'm gonna try to make as much as I can, but I just know how bad Tuesdays are. So yeah, um, really excited I got this order. I obviously, not gonna get an add-on for an order like this so i'm gonna go go ahead and go inside and knock out this order and yeah i'm i'm just really excited i got this order anyways i'm gonna knock this out and yeah i'm just surprised that today's going going like this start off really bad and then look at me you get two 59 dollar orders in a row so that's that's amazing let's get it all right guys um it is now 155 i uh just parked about three minutes ago that order went from a 59 to a uh 55 because the customer wanted a bunch of wines and there was one bottle of wine she wanted four of them they were 31 dollars a piece they were all out i tried calling no answer i uh i tried uh, messaging no answer and i was like i only needed two more items I was like, no, 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 I cannot refund 120 ish dollars worth of groceries because that's gonna really hurt the tip. So thankfully she had another number in the delivery instruction. So I star 67 the number so I can block my number obviously. And so I made the phone call. She answered and was like, oh, just give me four of these. They were only like $13 cheaper, but still that's 13 times uh, four. You guys figure that math out. I'm not gonna do that on camera for you guys. But that's a lot of money still. That uh, So that's why the, the, the order went down four bucks. But if I didn't decide on doing that, then you know, I had a, I would have had a refund that much money and it could have dropped to like a 45. So, and they also tried giving me two add-ons. I'll put them on the screen for you guys. But I'm like, I'm not gonna do a nine going that way or an uh, easy nine. I wanna put all my attention on this customer so yeah anyways i was saying that um when you have a really good uh order and uh it's one customer try to if if if, if you get a really good add-on offer then obviously take it but if you get a little crappy nine dollar order or like a little seven eight dollar add-on right it's not really worth it because you want to give your full attention to that one customer because it's a good order you know you don't really come across $50 orders for one customer and uh, that often anymore so it's like give it give it your all to that one customer um, I got a $24 order it's not great but I only waited like five minutes and it's uh, one customer going like three miles it is 35 items 48 units one customer it's it's fine I'm at 140 I'm gonna knock out this order. I'm gonna be at 164 after this by three o'clock. And you know, I could, I'm, I'm just, I didn't wanna sit and wait for another hour. You know, I just wanna keep the keep the ball rolling, keep it going, keep the momentum on my side. I'm gonna go ahead inside, knock out this order. I feel really good right now. I, I cannot complain. My my friend, he, he ended up getting a $20 order at Costco and he hasn't seen much at all today. So I can't complain, uh, especially for a Tuesday, so. Let's get it, let's run inside there, kill this order, and I'll let you guys know when I get my next one. All right guys, it is 3.08 right now. I pulled up back to Ralph's at 3.05. Um, I'm at 165 right now. All right guys, so now it is now uh, 4.15. Uh, I just got a $30 order. It's not really good, it's for two people. It's 28 items, 58 units going 10 miles. Second delivery is going back towards um uh, the stater brothers that i normally work at so i'm gonna go ahead and knock out this order and drive back there this order will put me at around 195 so i, I had to wait about an hour and 15 hour 10 minutes for this uh pretty average order but i'll take it it's gonna put me right underneath 200 so yeah I'm gonna go knock out this order and I'm gonna let you guys know when I get back to Seder Brothers. I'm aiming for around 5.30, it's 4.15 right now. So let's get it. All right guys, so I finished that order at 5.20. Uh, it took me about 20 minutes to get back here. There's a lot of traffic. And so uh, 5.41 just right now and uh, I'm at 195 and I am, 
I don't know. It depends on what my next order is. If I can get a good order, I'll go home. If I get a small order, I'll come back for one more. I'm not working tomorrow, so I would like to hit over 200. So any order that I grab, it'll put me over 200. So that's the play. I'll let you guys know if and when I get my next order. Let's go. All right, guys, so it is now 640. Um, I, I waited for a whole hour, just, just over one hour. I seen a couple of $9 orders, but um, I was kind of just waiting for something better. And then of course nothing showed up so another nine dollar order popped up so i just said screw it uh it's gonna put me over 200. i i should have just took the nine that i seen earlier and went home with that but you know i was i rolled the dice it did not play out right but uh yeah it's 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 easy it's four items seven units going 0 0.9 miles and i'll just call it a day after this um can't say i'm disappointed but definitely wish I made more considering that I that I've had two $50 orders today but you know you know there's an order here 45 minute to an hour and a half wait then there's a, a order here 45 minutes to an hour wait so it is what it is but I'm gonna go ahead and uh, knock out this order I don't really get add-on offers with uh, nine dollar orders that don't go that far uh, from what I've noticed uh, if I get an add-on I'll let you guys know but i'm gonna go knock out this order and i will see you guys back at the house with a quick recap so let's get it all right guys so uh, i ended up canceling that nine dollar order and the reason why is because it was only four items seven units but she wanted two flowers i just checked i uh before i you know um started shopping i was man the sun's terrible right now before um, I started, I, I clicked the start shopping button. I uh, went to go see if they had the flowers. They did not have them. And honestly, it's not worth the headache. I know it's a flat $2 tip, but it's really not worth it because, you know, when customers don't get their items, they could use that against us and give us a bad rating or something. So I'd rather stay, I'd rather stay away from that for a $9 order. I know ratings don't really matter anymore, but. I, I just I just don't want to have to deal with it, and uh, I just I just canceled it, and I'm gonna wait a little bit longer for either another nine dollar order or for uh, uh, so hopefully something better. Hopefully this little gamble pays off, but I wasn't having it. I wasn't gonna do that. So um, if she wants her flowers so bad, she can go to the store and get them herself, leaving her two dollar tip. So I'll let you guys know when and if I get my next order. So let's get All it. All right, guys, it is 7:46. I just made it home. Uh, I was about to give up. I was about to just call it quits and then I took a uh, average $12 order it ended up going up to $13.50 so that put me at a total of $208 today uh, about 12 and a half hours again um, I got to the store at 715 got home at 745 so obviously with all the hours I put in if I don't hit 250 plus I, I'm not really I'm not really impressed I mean, today's goal was only 150 just because it was Tuesday. However, working 12 hours and not taking any breaks, like going offline and whatever, it's not really impressive. I'm not really impressive about, uh, impressed by it, but you know, I'll take it any day of the week. If I, if I can make $200 six days a week, you know, that's, that's amazing, right? I'm gonna go ahead and get out of here, guys. I made 208 Tuesday, May 24th. Uh, if you can do me a huge favor and leave me a like, you can subscribe to my channel if you're new and hit that notification bell. That way you're notified every time I drop a video, drop a comment down below, tell me something, talk to me. And until next time, I'm out. Peace.